I just made this video uh, which uh, shows me doing a long fight with the Typhoon H and uh, since it's a long fight I thought it would be interesting to see actually how far I flew with it and uh, I came up to a distance of like 3000 feet or something like that anyhow people have been asking me how did you uh, get that uh, telemetry data integrated into the video and I did that using this software called Dashware it's free to download uh, but it's uh, a bit of a hassle to actually get it working with the SD16 telemetry data and the Typhoon H anyhow uh, you to do this you need to uh, put the SD card into the ST16 copy all the flight logs to the SD card and put that into your computer after that you need to of course install Dashware it's available at dashware.net over here and it's free download after doing the installation of that you need to delete the mfplat.dll file from uh, the dashware let's see over here c x86 and uh, dashware over here so you have that file over here somewhere personally i didn't delete it i just moved it to a new folder in case i will need it in the future if you're running Windows 7 or Windows 8 you might not need to do that but under Windows 10 you're obligated to actually do it otherwise you won't have video playback in Dashware and you can't actually create these videos after that to actually get the telemetry uh, reading in uh, Dashware you need to download this file the unique Q500v2 file from uh, the unique forum <coughs> I will provide links for all the files in the description of the video and uh, when you have done that to actually find where you need to put that file that's located over here it's under C users various known documents dashware data profiles just copy and paste it here and uh, start the program and it will, it will show up for you then the final step is of course even though you have done all this you still can't use the telemetry data you've extracted from the ST16 because the dashware software doesn't know how to read these uh, CSV files which are extracted from the ST16 so you need to convert them to a format which is readable and you do that with this uh, software Q500Log2KML and uh, that's available on Unique Forum as well and uh, if you have a lot of the uh, log files on your SD16 it will show up like this log1, 2, 3, 4, 5 uh, etc and then you see the actual data for example the date created in uh, the overview display the actual created day for the files which uh, you put in the computer will be wrong since uh, you, you actually moved it to an SD card so the created day will be the day you have moved it but you get all the data and information you need program and uh, you convert it to let's see if I open up the program myself it's some specific software uh, I mean file format dash hv dot csv is the format that you're supposed to choose and uh, you can see from my logs here the one I flew today for example this way here we go 16.6 .6 waves there 
yeah anyway i hope you actually get this uh, software running and uh, i hope you enjoy it and uh, if you like it leave a comment in the uh, under the video uh, click subscribe to my vi uh, my channel and uh, i will provide you with uh, a lot more flight videos i will provide you with various other videos as well and uh, maybe a few more upcoming tutorials we'll see about that take care